Hi everyone, this is Kristen with The Tech Reviewer, and today I'm here with a quick unboxing and review of the MagSafe charger and 20 watt power adapter that I just picked up at my local Apple store. Really excited about this new functionality for the iPhone 12 series. Of course, my iPhone 12 Pro is not going to be here till Friday, but in the meantime, I thought we could just do a quick unboxing of these products and check them out. Let's get started. The MagSafe charger costs $39 if you're buying it in the U.S., but that's only going to give you the charging puck. It's not going to give you your wall adapter. If you want to get your power adapter, the 20-watt power adapter that's recommended, that's going to set you back another $19. I got this here in Shanghai, China, as you can tell from the labeling. So unfortunately, that was a little bit more expensive even than the $39, about $49 U.S. So we got our warranty information, regulatory compliance, safety and handling, etc. Nothing very exciting here. And then opening this up, you can see we've just got a beautifully arranged package here. They've just been getting better and better with their packaging. I love the fact that we don't have any plastic in the packaging. This is all paper. Should be fully recyclable. Taking this out, little paper tabs holding this in place. Notice we have USB-C here. This is not lightning. Looks to me like this is just going to slide out. Here we go. Very nice. Looking here, you can see we've got metal around the edges, and then the center here looks like it might be ceramic. And then metal on the back. And as I said before, we just have our standard USB-C cable here on the other end. Obviously, we're going to need to unbox the USB-C power adapter in order to plug this in, so let's do that next. It's a little bit irritating that these are not coming boxed with the iPhone itself, but... I can see their point. You do have a lot of people that have got a lot of Apple power adapters lying around. I'm definitely one of them. But unfortunately, you don't have very many that are this kind of a fast power adapter. I only just have the one, actually, from last year's iPhone 11 Pro, and that's only 18 watts. And when I asked in the Apple store, they said, in order to take full advantage of the MagSafe charger, I needed to get the 20-watt one. Don't really know whether that was true or not, but that's what they said, so I went along with it. And, well, it's USB-C power adapter. Looks really nice. Let's plug it in. To give you an idea of size, here's the MagSafe charger side by side with an Apple Watch charger. Basically the same thickness here, maybe just a tiny bit thinner, but obviously quite a bit bigger around. They use a similar sort of technology from what I understand. They're both magnetic induction charging. And I don't know about you, but I've always really liked my Apple Watch charger. There's something really satisfying about putting your watch to charge and hearing that click. Just a really fun product to use. I really can't wait to use this MagSafe charger with my iPhone 12 Pro. While I'm waiting for my iPhone 12 Pro to arrive, I can use this as a regular Qi wireless charger. It's not going to give you that 15 watts of wireless charging speed, but it is going to give you maybe 7.5 watts at a maximum. So looking here at my iPhone 11 Pro, putting that on there, starts charging immediately doesn't attach magnetically, although there is a very slight amount of magnetic attachment. You can feel it just like a little tiny bit, but it's not actually going to stick onto the back properly because the iPhone 11 Pro is not set up for that. Going outside the ecosystem here with the Galaxy S20 Plus, it's also going to charge that. And then here with my iPhone 11, you know, Spec Presidio Sport case, relatively thick, but immediately it starts charging. And of course you can charge something like your AirPods Pro as well. 
So that's about it. I can't really do anything else with this MagSafe charger until my 12 Pro arrives this weekend, but so far I think it seems like a really great addition to the Apple ecosystem. It's very slimline, very light, seems nicely made, although keep in mind that it's not exactly going to be inexpensive, particularly when you consider that you need both the MagSafe at $39 and you need your 20 watt power adapter at another $19 in order to make this new system work. But if you have the money, I think that this is going to be a must-have accessory for the iPhone 12.